Hi everyone, this is a quick recap of how to do the basic print command in idle. Um, remember to load up your program idle, I-D-L-E, you'll find that in the apps um, or in your launch pad. And then once you see the shell, and remember this is the, this is the output um, window, uh, you do not code in shell, um, but you'll be able to test some single lines in here if you really want to. What we create from here is a new file. Okay, so we've got a file, new file. And you'll see an untitled window. Make sure you just reduce the size of that so that we can see the output in the shell on the left and we can see the program on the right. Uh, and in this particular example, we're just going to use the print command. Make sure it's lowercase. So do not use capitals. And then put in a parenthesis or a bracket. And then with a speech mark, we're able to type in the text that we want to print out. Uh, this is also referred to in coding terms as the string. So this is the string that's literally going to print out on screen once we run the program. Remember there are two steps for running the program. The first step is to save the file. So please make sure you go to file and save. Pick a suitable name for your file and a location. I'm going to put mine on the desktop. I'm going to call it Hello World 1 because I already have a Hello World. Okay, now the, now the file is saved. I can go to Run and Run Module. And you should see the output of that program. Hello World, there we are. That's the string literally printed out. Now in today's lesson, you might also want to try out some strings that cover multiple sentences and multiple lines. In this case, you use the triple quotation marks. So that's three quotation marks. And then you should be able to print um, strings on a multiple line. Get to close it at the end. And then once again, reminder, please save the file uh, before you run the module. Here you go. We've now got a multi-line string. Okay, hopefully you enjoyed that tutorial reminder uh, and you'll be able to now print out literal strings on a single sentence and also on multiple lines. Good luck. <coughs>